How's it going, YouTube? We're back with some more Nexomon Extinction. In the last episode, guys, we uh, failed to uh, eliminate Vados and uh, Amelie's plan and whatnot, and she pretty much got us into prison. That's pretty much where we're at. It's called Lataria or Lataria. I, I don't know how to say it, but uh, that's what it's called. We're here. It's pretty much prison. And we need to try to find the Tyrant Egg because they took away my Tyrant Egg. Go into this place then. And we need to avoid guards completely. Switch to these. Okay, okay, okay. Good wallet, okay. We're here. That place. Man. Okay, well, it's fine. I got the green wallet though. But okay. Oh, I do apologize for the last episode being so freaking long. <laughs> I kid you not. I was just, I was just playing, bro. I was just playing. Wait, can we not go in these little? Oh, we can't. Oh, thank you. No, thank you. Why, why are they open? Why can't we just walk into them? Shit, that would suck. Okay, you go there. Oh, fuck. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, this place looks like a storage site. I shouldn't Atlas be able to tell if the tyrant is the tyrant is nearby? It's tremendously powerful object after all. Hmm. I'll be honest with you. I never sense anything special about that egg. Wait, what? Are you kidding me? It's a tyrant egg! It must be broken, dude. Whatever guys, let's check this place out anyway. So this is just going around boxes. What the fuck? Oh. Okay. Okay, this must be it. Wait, do we have all of it? It's perfect. With Navy's power. Impute onto the egg. We can use it to jump over the walls and escape this place. Let's go outside and find a good spot to use its powers. Wait, what? Yeah, I thought so. I was like, I'm missing I'm missing two more elements. What I say, like what? How is it all lit up? I was like, I'm in, I was like in my head, I'm, I'm missing at least one. At least. Oh, bitch. Oh, nice. Hiya. Maybe we do? Like, is that the only place that I can use this thing? Give him the pass? Yep, it's gonna put it Alright, gotcha, understood. It's annoying, but I guess. <laughs> Look at him. Buddy? Buddy? Come over here! Why don't you just come to me? Why? Alright. Have I made myself clear? But, but sir, Emily's orders! <clears throat> Excuse me. My authority is as good as Emily's. If you could put Danny here, I can get him out. Simple as it's that simple. Didn't they betray your guild? Why would you release them? This is Laria. 
This is, this is Lyria. Since when do you care about the guild's business? Last time I checked, you were just outlaws, not the guild's lapdogs. We pay you to keep our prisoners, and now we're paying you to let them out. Don't think too hard. You guys need to make up your mind. On my authority as Grand Master, I hereby pardon every single one of them. They are, they are nothing but innocent and naive tanks. Look, I'm already out. We're all already out, actually. Hey, look over there! They just escaped. How is that innocent and naive, huh? I also pardon them for escaping. I uh, okay, I guess. Come with me, Danny. I'd like to have a word with you. You sure thing. Let me just quickly get some uh, shards to be collected here. And a chest, I think. Right? Yeah. Of course I'm gonna come over here. Repel. Thank you! I had a- Dude, I was like, there has to be something I can use. Because it's so annoying. Avoids any wild battles in communication. You can enable this or disable this item. Oh my gosh. And avoids any wild battle, including caves. You can enable or disable this item. That's awesome. Thank you so much. It's, a, it's an item that, that like, I would just enable or disable. That is phenomenal. Excuse me. Fuck you. Even if I do escape, look at this. <laughs> I got guards out of here. That's like a, you know, just a straight path. Only one path. Okay, what's this place though? Oh, this was the place that I found by accident. If you guys remember a couple episodes back, I mentioned. <laughs> Alright then. What were you doing in Cadian, Danny? Edward, do you actually believe that Valos is a good idea? Even your own people are skeptical about the monster. That is not for you to decide. Baros is indeed fearsome, but he is also, but he is also a reasonable creature. You should talk to him sometime. It would do us all, Edward. Now, I have pardoned you simply because I respect you as a tamer. Your great deeds alone are what have earned you a second chance. Please do not waste it on such silly Hussein. I won't tolerate another misconduct against the girl. Keep your head down for a while, will you? Do nothing. All right, I mean, I'll try my best. All right. Our mentor wanted to, wanted to meet with us, didn't he? I heard that observatory is somewhere east. Okay, well, let me make sure everyone's healed. Nope, <laughs> nope, everyone's pretty much dead. Not everyone, but you know what I mean. Heal me up, please. Oh yeah, this was the place I made it to by accident. I think. I think if I go down, that's when it's gonna show like the little... No? Huh. Item. Okay, what do you want? Not worth. Of course, it's gonna be locked. Somebody's house. What is this? Oh, sorry. Ah, <laughs> oh, there's a warp. I thought I kid you not. That, that's what I was trying to find. Warp stone, and I was trying to see like, well, where the hell I came from. Like the, when I found this place by accident, because I think this is the place that I found by accident. A positive, but I think this is the place. Let me make sure by checking the warpstone. Yeah! Because from. Where is it? From the desert outpost, I went east, and I just followed that path, and I ended up here, and I was like, oh. This is new. <laughs> well, I was just, you know, exploring, walking around, you know? 
Right, let's go down here. Wait, no, I already went down here. Let's go east. Oh, what's up here? Another house? Locked, of course. Let's just go straight east. Okay, okay. It's another house. Go up here. Shard. Shard. Chest. Don't care about this companion. Nature shard. Ocean shard. I mean, that's the observatory. <laughs> Why are there two shops? What? What? Let me see. Ah, oh, my apologies. The guards in Ledger aren't fond of guilt payments. They won't. They would hate to see me doing business with you. Well, fuck you then. Who are you gonna send them to? Eh, whatever. Fuck you, then. I'm the best tamer there is, and you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna deny me? I would have given you money, a lot of money. Not, not a lot of money. I, I would probably give you chip, chump change. Cause fuck that. Probably on time. Eleven. Fine. Okay. Let's go into the. Actually, can we go further east? We can. Let's just see. Let me get these shots real quick and then we'll go to that. But I'm assuming it's the observatory. And actually, wait, hold on, what is in here? Ah, oh, he's a little guy. <laughs> Excuse me. In a bit, actually, I should call my little brother because I'm gonna want some lunch. The boy only had breakfast. Actually, let me check Discord for the boys. Okay, nature shard, ocean shard, is that a hidden item? Yeah, look at that! I know it's like a tiny bit of shining, just just, just, just in the back of this little rock right here. On top of that box, you know what I mean? So a little, little shine. Yeah, I'm assuming this is the observatory. You're a ghost? Long, long ago. The king of monsters, Amarcon himself, tried to overthrow this world with the help of his children. Victory. Victory in your grasp. So weak, so feeble, the puny humans were at our mercy. Their fate was ours to toy with. And it sure was fun as heck. Oh, how sweet indeed. The age of Nexomon was about to begin. Along with Father, he would cleanse this world from the human disease at last. Truly memories to be relished. <clears throat> Excuse me. But a traitor among among our brethren. M m machinated with demise. The one with too soft heart took pity on the l on the lowly morals mortals. Jeez, I couldn't read her fucking shit. Dina forsook forsook us and did the unforgivable. That little girl doomed our kind. So he's also one? The absence of a king drove the Necromon of, of the world into madness, which ig ignited, right? Ignited, ignited a wall among tyrants for millennia to come. Only a true heir from Armacon's bloodline can bring order and restore the natural balance of our planet. But our king was slain long ago. Armacon lives no longer. Yet Amakon's bloodline lives on. The story goes on. So he was one too. We did not foresee this. But Dana, the great traitor, had a, had a child. She bared a true heir to Amakon's infant power. And that heir is standing before me. Yes, indeed. Danny, you were. What? I was sticking the egg! You are Dana's son. You are Omicron's descendant. You are the future king of monsters. Our one and true ruler. 
dog. Are you sure about this? Hurry up, please. My very presence might attract dragons to this place. This is a human orphanage. Dina, you were living your own child, Armacon's heir, in a place that reeks with humans. I'm, I'm, I'm doing it. I'm messing up his voice. I know. I'm sorry. Danny will grow with humans. He must learn to accept them. A future king of monsters? Now I'm changing it up again. <laughs> a supreme metromon rotting in a place like this. And I'm to pretend that he's one of them? Come on. I'll never allow Danny to grow vile just like Armacon. Our father's hatred against humanity will end up with Dan. Then how am I supposed to explain to Danny about his supernatural powers when they show up? The other kids at the orphanage will surely be terrified. Give him this. What? What the heck is this? A tyrant egg? A fake tyrant egg. You will lie to him. Tell Danny that his powers or challenge from this from this object. Good gracious. You can't seriously think that your own son is dumb enough to be <laughs> Stay. There is no there's one more problem. When Danny becomes of age, dragons will realize that he's a tyrant. They will hunt him down. That's why that first dragon came to me. In the very like in the in the verse in the first episode. When Danny becomes of age, the, oh yeah, the, 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 hunt him down over and over again. I would like Danny to join the guild to ensure his safety. Working with humans will make him see what father couldn't understand. And then one day, Danny will become strong to claim Omicron's throne. A new king of monsters who loves both humans and Nexomon will rise. So I'm the new king. Damn right I am! Shit! <laughs> oh, when he's telling the rest of the room. The same story, so that way they can all. Oh, you want me to what? It's essential for Danny to believe that he's human. Fen Fenrir, you want us to pretend? You, you want us to pretend that we that we are powering up this fake tyrant egg? That's your idiotic plan. I can't afford to have Danny figure out. And that's why Atlas couldn't pick up anything from that. Like any like signal, any power. I can't afford to have. I can't, I can't afford to have Danny figure out his true nature too early. If we're not careful, Danny will go corrupted by his sheer power, just like Father did. This is stupid, girl. I won't play. I won't play a fool for you. Come on, Fenrir. If you want Father's bloodline line to continue, then this is this is my one condition. If you guys will play along. This is our last chance to make a difference. This will be your redemption. Damn, bro. This is honestly fucking awesome. Like, the, the twist. That is so hilarious. So I shall trick Danny into thinking that Amrakhan's heir is inside that fake egg. Hmm. I'm gonna call it something super dumb like Tyrant of Light. Or whatever. <laughs> will you help me, Elisa? Danny will seek your guidance and I need you to misguide him. That's so messed up. I'd love to see how this develops. I'll have Danny go visit... Go and visit each elemental shrine. Then your siblings will teach him how to control his own powers. Fine. Let the act begin. Damn. That's wild. Well, where the fuck is Dina? Because she should be one of you guys, no? Do you understand now, Danny? Emily did nothing wrong. Her dragons are indeed perfect. The dragon outbreak from 15 years ago was not an accident. It was caused by your own birth. Dragons aren't insane. They are afraid. They acknowledge you as the strongest of all tyrants. The true heir to Omicron. When the dragon attacked you at the woods, you realized that your powers were starting to surface. You were sent on a lame journey to meet us and learn how to control these powers. All under the pretext of hatching a fake tyrant egg. Sooner or later, you'd be strong enough to become the new king of Omicron. 
of the next one. Yes. Find your your ascensions. The tyrants will naturally stop fighting. Peace will finally be restored. But alas, Vados was quite unexpected. The operation is programmed to hunt the tyrants until the until the end of it, of days, including you, my dear. If you are slain by Vados, then Omicron's bloodline will truly end. There's no telling what would happen to the natural balance of the world. Ow. Oh, and, and here's Vados now. W what the heck is going on? Vados' power from this far away? That creature just keeps getting stronger. Who the fuck are a bunch of these dudes? Are these other chumps. Still, it's a param. This, this is Battles, the ultimate tyrant. Do not fear, my comrades. Excuse me. For Battles is the child of mankind, forged by science and nothing else. Under our control, he will slay every single accursed tyrant that dares stand in our way. His power is limitless, so, and so is our future. We will cower in fear no more. Please stand with me and Vados. Together, humans will retake the world. I'm curious if I'm pronouncing it wrong too. If it's Vados instead of Vados. Or Vodos. Excuse me, young tamer. Haven't you heard? It's an emergency. All tamers in the city must meet at the barracks right now. Fuck, there's nothing to explain, right? Just come with me. The, ob the, the observatory is closed. It's now closed. Okay, well, fuck me. Emily, you bitch. What did you say? It is ex it is ex <gasps> it is as I exactly it is exactly as I have told you. A tyrant has been spotted to the east. The girl that will test the extent of Vados' power against that tyrant. You can sit back and relax. You dare mock us? Are we unable to hunt the tyrants ourselves? This is Ladia. We have slain dozens of tyrants. The guild appreciates your service, but now you are obs obsolete. As a token of our gratitude, I come with a warning. Stand back. We don't know how destructive how destructive can battles be. We don't know how destructive battles can be. I think that's what they meant. Listen up. Listen up, guild slave. We do not care how powerful your ab abhorrent Nexomon thing is. This is our turf, and we do as we please. If a tyrant is nearby, we take we will take it down like we always do. Their fancy guild and battles can get lost. Ugh. Of course. Do as you please, General. But please be careful. Shut up, Edward. Get out of my city. Oh, Start to the east of Larry and fight the tyrant. Should, um, why can't I go back in there? There was a chest in there. Hey, Danny. Are we gonna help uh, the Lateran hunters? Excuse me. On the tyrant. I heard that there's a good bounty. I know, Coco. Fuck. Oh, come on. Didn't you listen to Edward? All I have to do is relax and let Vados do his thing. Whatever, I'm out. Don't count, don't count on me. Leave, pussy. You know, he's right. That doesn't mean look all scary, but so far, he hasn't gone berserk or anything. Oh well. Can I, I can't actually take a look. I also want to see how Vados fights that tyrant. Indeed. But can... That was spotted. Yeah, I know, Coco. Fuck. I want to get this damn item. This chest. Ooh, donut. All right. Now on the off, you guys are ready because we're already 24 minutes in. Uh, in the next episode, we will go take uh, take out that tyrant. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this episode, make sure you smash the like button down below. Subscribe to join the Beast Nation, and I catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.